Hi everyone, this is Mariah from Edinburgh Blooms and Luxury by Heaven. Today is the first video of 2022, which I thought would be a really good opportunity to just tell you about um, Luxury by Heaven. So you might have noticed I've changed uh, the like the little logo, um, I've renamed it. Um, just to explain what's going on and what have I got to offer for this coming year and why did I do this change. So you know that Edinburgh Blooms has been working um, for about a year and a half up until um, the end of the 2021 uh, where I started feeling that maybe it can benefit from a tweak, um, a mini rebrand, re like I don't like to use that word but in, a matter of fact it has got um, a little change to the name and the domain of the website which you may have noticed as well so if you go to edinburghblooms.co.uk you will then get moved straight to luxurybackheaven.com so you're still on the right website it's still me and everything that I've made I previously put on YouTube is still there so just don't get frightened by that but I uh, basically decided to get uh, an easier name, something that will work uh, outside the UK. A lot of people don't know Edinburgh, Edinburgh is in Scotland. So maybe you've never been to Scotland, you don't even know where Scotland is. Scotland's in the UK. <laughs> um, but this is where I'm based. But I just want to reach more people and I want to help more people. And I know there's a lot of people in America which are, or like other countries, obviously not just America, that are maybe looking for this type of product that I have to offer. So I'm still offering my organizers and shapers, but I'm going more into detail with the accessory side of things. Um, and I think kind of to summarize it, it's probably just an energy shift. Like I always get something towards the end of the year and the start of the new year. There's always a little change um, to how I feel and how I think. And I think it kind of brought on this change to the domain and the brand. Edinburgh Bloom still is there. It's under the luxurybackheaven.com uh, umbrella, which is in short, LBH. Like, I just love it. <laughs> Super chuffed I came up with this name because that was a struggle. Like you just don't know what would you what name to use. Who's gonna understand it? You don't want to be like too specific. People will be like, what? But yeah, um, this is me, Mariah, LBH, and Blooms. We're still here, um, launching um, a sort of newer website and domain. So please have a look. If there's anything that you might be interested in, uh, please let me know. I'm just going to show really, really quickly the stuff that I've put on the website. They are made by myself to order for your bag. So everything's made for your specific bag. Um, even if you choose a specific Gucci pillow, it is for your Gucci bag. It's not just a Gucci, like any Gucci. So therefore, if you're in, t in, the, in any uh, sort of doubt, please do get in touch because I'll be able to direct you to the right product. Um, I'm going to start with the easiest one because I've got my um, Never Full On Me. I really love this never for like I hardly use it it's a shame but I really really love it just because of the uh, pink interior it's just beautiful so the first thing I thought I know like a lot of people in the UK or America they go on Etsy and I get it that Etsy is a handmade um, um, website to start with but actually the stuff that I seen it for this particular product which I'm prepping now so I could show you what it does um, it's it's not handmade like it is handmade, but it's not made in the UK, it's not made in the US, and um, people a lot of the time just buy something and sell it for a lot more than it is, and they've not actually made it. So that's quite annoying. And for this particular product, it would be the Never Fool uh, Cincher. So that is this little thing that you put on your bag, okay? So, oh, sorry, I done it the wrong way. Oops, um, I'm going to change it. Yeah, so j just these little things. Uh, first of all, overpriced, like they've not even been made for, you know, by the person who sold them. So I just got kind of a bit annoyed thinking um, that is just not good enough um, and people should have something nicer um, to choose from. So um, although I don't cinch my never feel, I know about one problem you can have. Uh, just a sec. I'm just clipping this one. Um, it's just hard to do because I'm talking, but it's actually really easy to do. Um, I know a lot of people that want to do it, they'll be using these. The problem with these, if you've got an older bag, they get dry. And I heard of people that this actually snaps. So the little, it actually 
cracks and snaps here and then you can't do it anymore and you've got to go to Louis Vuitton and change the whole thing and cost you money. The safest, safest way I would recommend to cinch your bag, you're never full, GM, MM or PM, is with a cincher. So this is mine, Luxury Back Heaven. It's got the little star, it's got the hearts. And there's another style which cinches it even more. So if you're super cinchy, can you say that? Uh, yeah, if you're super cinchy and you just want to like do it and forget about it, I'm going to put the second one on. And there's so many styles to choose from. Some of it are on the website, some I can still design for you. So please, please just don't hesitate to ask for one. And the other one is just a single clip. So that one's a double clip. And this one's a single clip. So you can see it's sort of tighter. Okay. And it's just got a lock and some keys. And it's the little heart shaped. So these are on the website. Please have a look. I know it doesn't come through very nicely on YouTube, but please have a look. Okay. Um, second item, wristlets. I do kirigamis conversions and get asked all the time have you got a wristlet where do I get a wristlet <laughs> what is a wristlet a wristlet is a clip it clips on with your onto your keys or your little pouches it could be any pouch it could be any SLG the clip works on anything okay so there you are and it just goes on your hand and you clip it to your little um kirigami for the purpose of the video, I'm going to clip it onto the pochette, which I don't, I'm not going to use it like that. But you might want to use it like that, that's fine. Okay, here we are. It's just a little dainty one. I really like the pink ribbon. You don't have to go for the ribbon. Um, you don't even have to go for the charms. You can just literally just go for a really super classy and basic um, chain only. No problem at all. Um, and obviously I can make it longer, I can make it shorter. Um, this one is it's pretty long, I would say. Probably fits any type of hand. So this is product number two. Um, and there's other products on the website. Have a look. Maybe you'll see something that you like. Maybe there's something that you're thinking of and you want to ask me about. That's okay as well. Um, the second item I've categorised on the website is my shapers. So this one particularly is made for the Speedy 25. It is on my website, you would see it in most pictures just because I love, love this fabric. It's a tartan. If you want to call it Burberry, you can call it Burberry. It is not a Burberry. It's Burberry style. <laughs> okay, so this is my pillow. So I've got lots of satin to choose from. I've got crushed velvet and you've got my little tartan ones. So lots of bags that I've put uh, there's different sizes for the shapers. So those are it's the same as everything made to order for your particular bag. Uh, going back to the straps, we have got the Viketa straps, which are actually quite hard to find sometimes. Um, and you don't know if you're getting the one that's been coloured, so it comes sort of brownier, but it's, it'll never ever go darker. Whereas with my ones, they will go darker because they're proper Viketa that I, like Louis Vuitton uses on their bags, like here, for example. So that goes darker. So the straps are there as well. They're also... Um, specifically for your bags who so just get in touch and ask me what bag have you got in mind that you need a strap for. Um, what else have I got there? I've got two more things to show you. This is a new one. It's not going to get a proper exposure now because I'm going to work on an actual launch. I don't like that word, but it is sort of a launch. And that is my little base shapers, which are made of satin and they are padded. It's got the same filling as in the um, bigger felt base shapers. This one is for small bags, Chanel's, Gucci's, uh, small Louis Vuitton bags. Nothing that's got too much bulk in it and will be too heavy. So here we go. Made to order for your bag. They will be on the website very, very soon. I'm just working on the sizes that I can make it for. And the last, and that is that is just my favourite. <laughs> like I am addicted to pom-poms. And this is just one of the pom-poms that you can get on the website. It is just beautiful. Lots of colours to choose from. Got beige, pinks, blues, black. I think I've got black. Uh, uh, have I got a red? Yes, I've got a red. I can get those um, in any colour that you want. This is my favourite because it goes on just about anything. 
So I think that covers just, just about everything that I have changed. Uh, I'm still here, you can still see me. Um, maybe there's some content that you'd like me to bring to you, so let me know. Otherwise, I am filming a second video today, which is my first designer bags. So that is my personal experience of buying first designer bags. So if you want to watch that, please do. Uh, it might come up automatically if not just go into my account and you should be able to see it. Um, please find me on Instagram. I'm still on Edinburgh Bloom's Instagram and Facebook, but I've also got a luxury bag heaven accounts. So you can find me there. The website is the same. So have a nice day and thank you for watching. Bye.